Next step on Jeep Pete, we are gonna set the distributor timing and then trim these all to length and get them plugged in. All right, on an AMC 304 V8, the Jeep book says to set on the compression stroke, everything on top dead center, which we have done. We've got top dead center lined up with that timing mark. Keen and I have confirmed that cylinder number one, which is this guy, is on the compression stroke. And we did that by putting our finger over top of the hole driving it and making sure we got compression. So next step, run number one wire to the tune distributor, which is next on the list. So we need to decide and mark that distributor cap on where that's gonna hit so that we connect that to number one. And then we'll go through the firing frequency, which is actually noted, thanks AMC, right there on that intake manifold. Okay, Keen and I believe that this is the best position for this distributor so that we can get this vacuum line out. We've got room here for the right side of the engine. We've got room coming through here for the left side. So we've gone ahead and we've marked that location. We've lined it up with that distributor, uh, that rotor inside. And go ahead and put the distributor cap on some. And then what we've done is we've marked the distributor cap as yellow. Go ahead and clunk, clunk, pop those clips. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take all of these wires, we're gonna trim them to the right length, starting with cylinder number one. All right, clipping the last end on, we've got everything cut to length, so if we squeeze this guy, what it does is it crimps those together nice and tight. So we have a look at that guy. As you can see here, that's how it crimps that over, nice and tight. Pull the boot on, install, done and there we have it that is distributor on that is timing set just as close as we can make it based on what the jeep book says we've got all the wires trimmed to length routed in there just as clean as we could make it look really pleased with the way this has come out so these are 8.4 millimeter thick wires we should not get any crosstalk between these high performance wires and the routing is really looking pretty clean we've got clips holding everything on looking nice and clean versus being draped over the engine really proud of Keen for helping me pull this off we are getting closer to firing up this amc 304 v8